What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here, joined by the lovely Beauty. Welcome to Beauty and the Beast. What's going on, baby? How you doing? Hey guys. I'm doing good. Now, I know how you've been doing. I live with you. I sleep with you. I know you've been doing well. I know a lot of our subscribers and viewers be wanting to know what's happening with the missus. We actually got um, a few requests for you to do Beauty and the Beast. I mean, no, I'm sorry, to do Beastly Thoughts. There's so many <laughs> Beastlies out here. Uh, to do Beastly Thoughts with us. And I'm trying to get her on, guys. I want her to, to do it. I don't know, you know, if she will or not, but I think it'd be great if she does do it every now and then. Maybe get on once. Hey! Maybe stop. one of these days. I think she, she'd be a great addition to uh, the uh, to the show. She's a, a very knowledgeable gamer, and uh, she thinks that she doesn't know enough. And so that's the thing. She just thinks she doesn't know. She's very knowledgeable. Stop camping, fuck twat. Okay, but um, what's been going on this week? There's been a lot going on with you. Um, I'm transitioning between jobs. Transitioning between jobs. What? So we all know that you've been working, working at, for Apple. Been doing the Apple thing quite a while. Um, and uh, she's been working for Apple since Eve took the first. And she's all she's always been, you know, a, you know, an Apple representative. Stop it. You stop it too. Stop it. There you go. Um, okay. Oh, well, I got him for it. And there's another one. Good I stuff. Good job, baby. Uh, and so now she's going to be going and, uh, you know, venturing off and doing some other things. Let me throw some smoke, guys. Oh! And he got me. Got no. And she's going to, uh, you know, try something new. What are you going to be doing now? Um, well, since Apple was all sales, I'm getting out of the sales and going to customer service and tech for AT&T. Customer service! That's what I'm talking about. You ain't gonna kill me, son. I'm the Beastly Gamer. Yeah, so she's gonna be doing customer service. Hey, guy. Yeah. And, and a little tech support. Tech support! Tech support! Hey, dude. I don't know how he escaped that. The, the wrath. I'll just be working on the wireless cell phone. Ooh. No uh, universe Ooh. or... Well, I'm, I, I think you'll do well. I, th I think everything you do, you uh, everything you work toward, you excel at. She's full snap, very knowledgeable young lady, very hard worker, and uh, no matter what you do in your life, I'll... I'm very proud of you, and I think you're going to do it. No, no biggie. You're oh, going to smash it. Now, uh, you're going to be taking some classes. How long are the classes for AT&T? Uh, right now they're four hours a day for 26 days. 26 days? Yeah. Uh, Unfortunately, it's unpaid. Yeah, that's something I don't. They, they want they want to kill your, your time. They want to kill... I know somebody's right here. Oh, hey, buddy. Um, it's a, there's a lot of time you invest. Hey, baby. I see you appear in front of me. Uh, and, and four hours a day... You know, not getting paid for that's, four hours yeah, a day. Yeah, that's before the homework and the yeah, and all that stuff. Is, all that stuff is secondary. It comes afterwards. Chump! I'm gonna go up there and kill that. Um, but uh, you know, you've already started your classes, and uh, I know you're gonna do well. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, I first week down. First week down. You got five weeks to go. This guy. Would Oh, got both of you losers, because I'm the beastly gamer. Um, so yeah, you got five weeks of training coming your way. I think you do really well at it. And you're uh, actually getting ready to start going to school, right? Um, yeah. It's, it's hopefully, something that you have in, in the works. Yeah, hopefully I'll be starting in August. The college education. Going back to school. College is a very serious thing, and if you do well enough, I can be a housewife, and that would be great. Huh. Take time off. To a zoo. Well, it might be you might like the zoo that I make. <laughs> Man, I'm destroying these guys. I'm sorry, guys. It's so hard to stay focused, doing the Beauty and the Beast, and at the same time killing these fuck twats. But you know we'll do it. Let me go ahead and bring my big boy out because that's what I do round hill, beastly gamer. So you got school, you got work, oh, you got crap. raising a household. You just got everything on you right now, and that's so intimidating. I don't know how you women do it, and and. These, uh, this day and age, it's just a hard call. Hey, dude, you're running kind of fast. There's a lot going on. If you run that fast, it makes it hard for me to shoot you like this guy. Hey, guy. Um, 
Oh man, I almost killed my own guy. He's lucky he wasn't hardcore. Uh, you thinking about improving your vision too? Oh yeah, yep. The LASIK surgery. Kate is is thinking about doing getting LASIK, and so, uh, it's something I really. Blind. She is, guys. She's she's she can't see shit. And uh, I really do want to go ahead and pay for LASIK for her, get it done because I don't think anybody should be as blind as she is. She is absolutely blind. I didn't even pull my torrent out. I didn't oh. even pull it out. Well, I did okay. Someone did get a higher score than me, but I didn't pull out my turret, and my wife got the last last kill because you suck, son. And we're talking shit through the PlayStation camera so you can hear me, and I can't hear you. Yeah, I'm just kidding. You guys subscribe to the channel. Anyway, uh, LASIK surgery looks very painful. Yeah. But I heard that it's not. It looks very painful. It's like if, if I saw someone pull some dude's balls off, and then the guy looked at me and said, "Hey, it doesn't hurt." I wouldn't believe him. When you see LASIK surgery. Uh, it looks like it's excruciatingly painful. They, they put your eye on the machine, they slice open the top layer of your eye, pull the little flap of skin back, and then... Flap, yeah, and then they burn your first layer of the cornea. Burn your damn cornea out of your eyeball. Uh, you know, uh, yeah, because but you're you can't not the one that has to go through it. Yeah, I know you don't have to, I don't want, because God cursed me with 20-20 vision, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah. But your vision is so bad. I mean, I, I feel really bad when you don't have your glasses on or your contacts because she really cannot function. I'd like to wake up in the morning and see the clock without me. She can't see <laughs> shit, guys. I'm telling you now, if she had a piece of paper you stuck it two feet away from her without her glasses on, all she sees is a white square. It's just it's crazy. outlines. Yeah. She sees shapes. shapes. Basically. <laughs> and uh, so LASIK sounds really good. We're going to look into the best doctors, the ones who have the best reviews in our area. You'll be uh, joining the ranks of the visually un uh, un unimpaired. Yeah. Unimpaired. <laughs> yeah, you'll, you'll be able to see shit. That that'll be nice. Yeah, let me see. No glasses, no more. Oh, good job. Thanks, baby. See, guys, it's teamwork. A family who plays together stays together. Someone's upstairs. Maybe be careful. He's up. He's up. He's upstairs. I just saw him right up. And now, oh, this dude got skilled. You see him? Nope, shotgun didn't get me, baby. Because I'm a beastly gamer. Yeah, but um, we went, guys. We oh. went. I'll save that for last. Actually, that's the best the best story. We uh, have found out her ex-employer has acquired Dr. Dre Beats. Apple <laughs> has bought for Dr. Dre's Beats. What do you guys think about this? Uh, they, they've acquired Beats for $3.2 billion. Dollars. Which is a, a shit ton of money. Uh, that is absolute dog shit. Do you see the the damage this guy did with that shotgun? He's been yeah, murdering he, everybody. He murked the entire team. But you know, I'm the beast of gamer. I'll go ahead and handle it for us. That's a lot of money to give anybody, to give one company, anything like that. You got 3.2 billion dollars for some fucking headphones. I do understand that the headphones are very, very popular amongst the youth. <laughs> And uh, amongst audio files, that's something I want to see. I, I want Briar Rabbit to, um, to. Uh, oh, here he comes with his magical shotgun. Hey, dude, you're not the shotgun, dude. You can't jump like that. Um, but yeah, uh, Briar Rabbit, I'd like to see him uh, review some Dr. Dre Beats headphones just for the <laughs> just for the audio that that they pump out because you know the audio of those things are really top notch. You really can't beat them. They're very popular. Extreme. And working at Apple, you said Apple, uh, you guys sold tons Sells, of them, right? Yeah. See, I'm I sure that's why they bought them, because during the holidays, at least four out of five people bought them. Wow, I don't know why I try to do that. Making myself look bad. Yeah, so Dr. Dre beats. Jeez, what's going on here? My, my goodness. Oh, that's what it is. Uh, Dr. Dre, the richest rapper of all time. He's like Muhammad yeah. Ali of rap. No, he, he is. Greatest of all time. You with this, and I had to reload. You lucky son of a bitch. We went, guys, to the movies uh, yesterday, and we saw a movie that. Uh, how do we say this? We went and saw the Amazing Spider-Man too. Mm. And was it amazing? No. The movie wasn't amazing at all. We're not going to spoil anything for you guys. I wish we did a spoiler cast to let you guys know just how terrible it was. But uh, it just was not good, in my opinion. There was so much uh, left. 
<laughs> in the who's dark, and, and the story of the game was just who's coming. Tell oh. me about it. I killed. I killed somebody. Uh, the the movie man. We got an hour in, and then Kate looked at me. and She said, "I guess this is one of those movies where uh, all the action all happens the action in the happens last, happens in the last ten, minutes. ten minutes." And uh, I was like, "No." You don't believe me. I said that can't be true. They're gonna, um, they're gonna do something, and basically, she was absolutely right. We watched the movie. The last ten minutes of the movie. These are all the action was. And the action was not good. And see, the thing is, when you, the thing is, when you uh, have seen something like Captain America, the Winter Soldier, and then you, you're, you come back to, yeah, take that shotgun, dickhead. Oh my goodness. Um, when you see something like that, please, please oh. kill someone. Please. Uh, when you see... Oh, man. Let me take your gun, dude. Oh, what do I got here? Do I have a shotty? Oh, I sure do. Oh, no! <laughs> Come on around and let my turret do its business. Hey, oh, you're waiting for me to spawn. Spider-Man was just not good, guys. Bottom line, I'm sorry. We're playing and talking, multitasking, and it's pretty f***ing hard, okay? Uh, Spider-Man just didn't do it for me. Oh, I, I was liked. I was very underwhelmed by the experience. It and was hyped up way more than it should have been. Yeah. Uh, bottom line, it just was not a great movie. I just wasn't excited for. Oh my goodness, we got Teen Wolf coming up behind me, and we only got 43, 43 fucking points. Wait a minute, where's this guy going? Wait a minute, dude, come back. Gotcha. Um, it just wasn't good, guys. That's just the bottom line. And if you've seen Spider-Man, comment in the comment section and let us know if you liked it because we didn't. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today for this episode of Beauty and the Beast. We're going to keep you guys updated on what's going on with us and our very slow lives and our, <laughs> our, our insane children that scream even though they're supposed to be in bed asleep. You guys take care of yourselves and we'll see you next time. Bye guys.